do have here our state treasurer, Bruce Baldwin. He likes to talk. Um, so I'll give you an opportunity. Um, we didn't have any specific question for you, but I know Maine State Housing has been in the news lately and thank you against uh, the director there. Would you like to elaborate, explain a little bit where you're coming from with that issue? <clears throat> you bet. Our state is broke. And as soon as we all understand that and accept that, we're going to be better off moving forward. I sit on the boards of seven what we call quasi-independent authorities. These are agencies, if you will, that were created by the legislature over the years to provide very specific services to the people of Maine. For example, the Maine Turnpike Authority. However, that's the one board I do not sit on, but I wish I did. I've been very concerned, as the governor has been, and how taxpayer money is being spent by these authorities. The one that Adrian just mentioned is called the Maine State Housing Authority. Now, they do several things, one of which is the governor mentioned they distribute the lie heat money to help folks put oil in their tanks for money. They also funnel state, federal, and local tax money, tax dollars, to build affordable apartments. <coughs> We have 6,500 families that are homeless in the state, greatly disadvantaged. They are on a wait. The prior governor appointed this individual for a four-year term. That term extends into February 2014. Our governor LePage will still be our governor. However, during the four-year term, that individual is accountable to nobody, including our board. So what will be introduced in legislation and I'm looking at Representative Black and Representative Duff, and they are strong-willed individuals who are fiscally disciplined, I know. There will be legislation introduced that does a very simple thing. It makes the executive director of the Maine State Housing Authority accountable to the board, just like every other executive director in the state of Maine. When that happens, I can assure you that the board appointed by the governor, we'll be making some very badly needed changes there. Our goal is very simple. We are stewards of your money. It is not our money, it is your money. You are the customer. You pay the bills. We have to be very cost efficient in spending the limited amount of money we have. And you all ought to thank, and I know you will, the governor for his leadership in this area. I, I would just like to add one more thing about the State Housing Authority. We are trying to climb our way out of the worst recession since the Great Depression. And the management at the Maine State Housing Authority have been receiving 6% increases every single year since 2005. It is time we say enough is enough. They've gone from $7.5 million, seven a little over $7 million in 2005 to $8.7 million in management wages. It's, and no one makes, well everyone makes, every single one makes more than what a governor makes. Well everybody up here makes more than a governor. <laughs>